Good morning everyone, Arjun here aka Golf Clash Kane. This is the complete walkthrough of front 9 holes played in the weekend round of expert division in the ongoing big top tournament. Please note that the shots I will show might need some tweaks and adjustments in order for yours to work. Again, this is just a reference guide, just copying and pasting the shots will never work across any division. If you feel my adjustments are off or wrong, you always have an option of waiting for other streamers to upload their content. Having said that, if you follow this playthrough and make the necessary changes, you will have a good chance of scoring minus 15 or lower on the front nine. Now, without any further ado, let's start with hole number one. Hole one part four. This one I'm playing with my big topper level four and a Titan ball. We have a slightly tailish crosswind going left to right. Full toss spin, one left spin. And here, as you can see, my ball guard line. I placed it just right of the second bush there. And I adjust this one for max plus 10% and then push it to max. We push it to max. And then outer wall, left go, max OP. Try to hit perfect. Perfect shot! We'll take a very nice bounce on the rough and then roll at a very nice range for the wedge. Shot number two will be played with your wedge, which might be the rapier or the end bringer. In my case, rapier level six, as this is a low, uh, low level account. Now, adjusting the spins will bot guard line dead center of the cup. Elevation max. Uh, sorry, elevation 40% with 85% slider. And I drop this shot with a great left. It will also drop with a perfect, but it will miss with a great right. So great left and perfect will give you the eagle. Great right will most likely miss. Again, 40% elevation at 85% slider. Great shot! We hit great left, but we still draw. Oh. Not hit a great right. Eagle! That can cause. Hole two, part three. This one we have a cross tailwind. And here I'm playing with my Goliath level seven. Nothing really to show here. I hit a great left on this one and I was away from the pin, but if I had hit perfect, maybe I could have stood a chance, but. Some tweaks that can be made, you can add a little more right curl. And if you want, if you're adding right curl, then you can keep the same amount of right spin or you can increase the right spin and uh, reduce the curl. Max plus 20% is what I played here. But again, I hit a great left, so cannot be sure of what would have been the outcome had I hit perfect. Great shot! It was not even a slight great left it was a double great left which is even worse but again a safe word. nice on hole three part five here we have a crosswind left to right i'm uh, playing with my big topper level four along with the bus circle wall because i do want to gain as much distance on the drive that was the plan but did not turn out the way i wanted it to be i caught a second uh, caught a dead bounce on my third and fourth bounces so that's why we ended up like 20 yards short we are looking for anywhere between 380 to 390 yards on the drive here full toss spin one left spin big topper level four elevation max plus 15 percent do not have any kind of 11 15 and pull here because most likely the wind is going to push you into the rough and it will be hard time making the eagle itself, let alone the albatross. Great shot! Great left, but we were still safe. Nice bounce on the fairway. You see, we the ball just died there. Did not catch the roll as I was expecting it to be. If playing for the albatross, the second shot will be played with the guardian. Uh, with full backspin and I guess maybe one left spin in most of the cases but again 
need to short on the drive due to short distance on the drive we are just trying to attempt the pin from the front here about 3.9 backspin there and 0.8 left spin keeping the ball guard line on the left side of the pin one green square elevation max plus five percent once i do the adjustment i check for the amount of rings i go into and same amount of rings will be applied in the overpower great shot great right will miss this one for the albatross but again a safe eagle so try to gain as much distance preferably 400 plus yards on the drive and you will have a good chance for the albatross all four part three Slightly headish crosswind, left to right, playing with the kingmaker. Three bars of right spin, one bar of top spin. Ball guard line going above the pin with the blue ring touching the rough on the left. And bullseye just before the shadow. Not exactly the bullseye, but like the green ring just before the shadow there, inside green ring. Now you will see that we come very close on this one. So what I need you to, to do is just tweak the curls in the practice arena first. I went with a click curl, maybe like two or three clicks will give you a good chance for a hole in one. Elevation, one is to one. Sorry, not elevation. The adjustment is one is to one. Perfect shot. Let's see, we'll come in close. And the spins are nice. You only need to tweak curl. About one five yards close to the pen. Nice job. Make the right curl and you will have a good chance for a hole in one. Hole five par four. Here I'm playing with the katana and extra mile level seven. Full toss spin, full right spin. Four and a half top, three right spin, and aiming the ball guard line center on the next fairway. See just right there. Now, the only thing here is that you do not want to catch the glitch roll and end up in the bunker on the right or the left. Because this is a must drop in any division because with a short iron, having good, good ball guard line, which might be Thorn, Hornet, Falcon, you can catch that funnel and all you need to do is hit perfect. Perfect shot. Elevation max plus 10% at perfect we are at a very sweet distance for the second funnel approach now having talked about the funnel approach you see we have a tailwind so less adjustment like even adjustment can be like minutely off and you will still drop the hole but here hornet level 6 does not have a fully developed ball guard line so i was trying to visualize a ball guard line going through the hole one thing to remember that the max toss spin you will ever need is 1.5. Anything above 1.5 combined with the tailwind, you will go very hot and you will miss the pin more likely. In this case as well, you, you will see that one toss spin was like very high and we missed it and we indeed came in very hot. Elevation 10% at 45% slider. Once again, the spins would vary. You need to find that funnel. Perfect shot. And it's a must drop in any division. Oh. See, we come in very hot. Oh. Just find the funnel. Nice the help of the ball guard line, and you will have a fun time on this hole. Hole six par five. Crosswind once again. Left to right. Extra mile level seven with the Titan ball. Four point five toss spin, two left spin. L very important to keep the ball guard line centered in between the loop there between the bunker like on the bunker at plus 14 yard mark adjusting this one for max plus 15 percent No need of any curl, just try to hit perfect. Perfect shot! Nice perfect drive. Second 
second shot attempting for the albatross if you are playing with the kingmaker you can go with the backspin approach uh, just before the rough here i was trying to go for the rough bomb because a i did not have a kingmaker second i do not have a fully developed ball guard line which would tell me how uh, would have how it would have been if i played the backspin approach so trying to find the rough bump approach with, with the ball guard line going through the hole and i play this one max plus 10 percent again if you have any better approach you can obviously go with that but with this approach we did miss it for the albatross but have a very safe eagle just make sure whichever approach you choose to go with you do not perfect shot you do not risk the eagle for the albatross we roll up miss it on the right but still a very safe putt for an eagle nice on all seven par four i scored an eagle here as well it is a very d difficult wind cross headwind playing with the quarterback two and a half right spin five bars of backspin at the plus one yard mark see just there plus one yard mark adjustment one is to one 9.1 miles per hour will be 9.1 rings I went slightly half ring into OP but uh, I did not use any OP whatsoever just try to hit perfect perfect shot great right great left should be safe because we have plenty margin of error here shot number two will be played with your goliath i'm using goliath level seven now you have a headwind here you do not want to clip the rough on the second bounce whatsoever so make sure your second bounce is way away from the rough pad there using their left spin accordingly keeping the ball guideline in line of the pin make sure the ball guideline is in line of the pin even though we are not in maximum distance we'll play this one max plus 20 percent center of the ball hit perfect Perfect shot! And we drop this one for a very sweet eagle. Oh. Eagle! Hole 8 part 3, here we have a tailwind. You can play this shot with a sniper level 10 or guardian. Because you need minimum 6.5 bar backspin. see we have six and a half bar backspin there now here what I did wrong is I offset it way to the left of the pin you need to offset it more to the right so maybe at the line joining the uh, the light and the dark green columns there elevation medium distance plus 10 percent once again in the practice arena do practice with uh, different offsets the spins are correct Perfect shot. If you feel we are still low on the backspin, you can go with more backspin. But if you offset it correct, then you might have a very good chance nice for shot. a hole in one here. Medium distance plus 10%. Finishing up on the front nine with final hole, hole nine par five. Here we have a cross tailwind, a power hook or a power slice may be possible but i would say with a higher level apocalypse six seven or maybe even five and a zerg ball you can take the bounce on the pad there but again we are playing with the low level clubs here so sticking with our extra mile level seven at plus seven at plus seven yard mark two left spin and 0.5 bars of backspin max plus zero no elevation center the ball and hit perfect Perfect shot! 
see we are at a very sweet spot for our second shot. Shot number two will be played with your power wood club, either the cataclysm or the big dog, in my case big dog level seven. Only aim here is to get a safe eagle, that's what I'm going to play for. I try to push out my target and see how many rings I would need to push up in order to have a safe clearance and you know be on the fairway or the fringe or the green. It turned out to be like half a ring to one ring. It would vary depending on the ball you are using as well. So two bars of right side spin. I played this one max plus 10%. Two right spin and seven bars of toss spin. And then I push up half a ring there. Half ball curl to the right. Try to hit perfect. Perfect shot! And you will see that with this shot, we are safely on the fairway for a very easy EB rule wedge shot for the eagle.